Hello friends, this is Miss Nikki from the McMinnville Public Library. I've got a fun book to share with you today. This one's called The Napping House. It's written by Audrey Wood and illustrated by Don Wood. They do a lot of my favorite story time books. The Napping House by Audrey and Don Wood, published by Harcourt Brace and Company. There is a house a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And in that house, there is a bed, a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that bed, there is a granny, a snoring granny on a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that granny, there is a child, a dreaming child on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that child, there is a dog, a dozing dog on a dreaming child on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. And on that dog, there is a cat, a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. And on that cat, there is a mouse, a slumbering mouse on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. And on that mouse, there is a flea. Can it be a wakeful flea on a slumbering mouse, on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. A wakeful flea who bites the mouse. Who scares the cat? Who claws the dog? Who thumps the child? Who bumps the granny? Who breaks the bed? in the napping house where no one now is sleeping. And that's the end of that story. I have a rhyme to teach you today. It's very easy to learn. You simply take two hands. We start with one. One hand can wave, hello. One hand can tap, tap your knee, tap, tap, tap. But they each need a friend if they want to clap hooray thank you for joining me in the story today i can't wait to see you at the library bye friends